some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we find ourselves just outside of Seattle, Washington, where we find a frauditor who is on school grounds filming buses. Now, luckily, there are no children on any of these buses, but still, that doesn't negate the fact that this guy is not all there. But still, though, why would you want to go on school grounds and risk being arrested to film children? That is just creepy. But at any rate, let's just sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Well, I had a video cut on me, so I had to have to splice it together a little bit later. There's another electric one. Oh, full stop. back at me. Oh, looks like I got company coming down. Nope, more than one. Two people at least. Hi, can I help you? No, thank you. Okay. Is there a reason? Yes. Oh, how come? I'm working on a story. Yeah, the generic, non-descriptive, frauditor answer of, I'm working on a story. No need for an explanation, and you'll never hear about what I'm working on anyway. And I will refuse to provide any explanation of what I'm doing. Blah, 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 blah. Typical frauditor script. Written by morons. Four morons. Oh, are you with the press? Yep. Do you want any interviews or anything? No, not really. I'm just working on a story. Okay. Let us know if we can help you. I appreciate that. <laughs> okay, thank you. What was your name? Well, your I, name? I can't hear you. I'm sorry. What was your name? What, 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 I, I'm sorry. What's your name? I asked first. What was your name? Well, it doesn't matter that we have to answer first. Well, I asked you first. I mean, you're public, you're public officials, are you not? Don't you work are, for the public? Are you? No, I'm I don't on, work. I'm on break right now. You work for the school district, correct? So what, what is your responsibility in, in answering our questions? Well, I'm a private citizen, not a public employee. Okay. Ooh, boy, you gotta love these jackass morons who come up with those lines. Tell me something. Does it make you feel all big and bad inside talking like that to these people? Trying to make them feel small when you are actually the small-minded little buffoon? You're a public employee. I am. So what was your name? I am. I'm on break right now. What was your name? Oh. Oh, so you're a nobody to come and talk to me then at all then, are you? Well, I'm, I think I'll have... Wow. Uh, I told you what I was doing. Well, you're not really being that much of I told you what I'm working on a story. Is that what I told you? Yeah. Okay. Fifteen minutes later. Is there anything we help you with? No, not really. Oh, yes, you can. There was a lady that just came down to talk to me two minutes ago. She was wearing a brown coat, uh, red, redhead. Uh -huh. I'd like her name at and uh, name, please. Yeah, why is that? A public records request. Yeah, then you make a public records request. You okay, great. I'll go in and make one. This but is, how do I make? Is, you go to the district no, office. I can make it. The late. This isn't the district office. The law states. This office isn't open to the public. The,
Yeah, for auditor, school grounds are generally not open to the public, and for very good reasons. First and foremost is for the safety of the children at the schools. You know, to protect them from wandering yahoos like you. It's not? No. Nobody can go in? Nope. This is secure for the bus drivers only and the transportation department. Okay, so nobody from the business card. Nobody from the public can go in here. No, it's secured for the bus drivers only. This is in the public office. Okay, so the doors secured. It nobody can go in. Yes, sir. Um, then why don't you just save me the hassle and give me your name? Sure, I'll give you my name. No, no, the, the gal thing who. Yeah, I'm not comfortable giving you her name. Well, how, how can I do a public name. records request on her if well, I don't you, know who you I'm? You can say the person who contacted you and describe her, and you can even include me, and I can help Human Resources get you that name. So, right. what, you don't have public visitor parking up here? It's not for public parking, no. This is for the business of the school district only. Oh. So what if I had business with the school district only? Uh, um, I'm sorry, sir? So what if I did have business with this? With this department. Go through the district administrative office. Oh. So that front door's secured. That's correct. That's why there's a uh, on the right side there is a secure key card only access for drivers and district employees. Well, how do I go go about getting your name? Because I should be able to go to the agency. And you can contact the HR department. Which is where? It's in the. It's on the business card. This is the address to the human resources department. Okay. Right. And that's. I'm the safety security director. You can ask them to ask me, and I can provide them the name. Okay. Great. And I also tell her that the record that she created on her phone is now public record. Okay. Well, and uh, that yeah. she's bet. She better not delete Who it. Who are you? Do you want to help share that? I'm. I'm. I. Uh, I. I'm making a story. Okay, you're also making a lot of people nervous. Okay, I mean, these nervous. are bus drivers that these are the bus drivers that drive twenty four thousand yeah, kids to from school. You're not very acting very professional if you're not. You're, most media people will share information. Okay, I don't. I sh don't want to share that information okay. yet. Right. But am I breaking the law by recording? No, you're not. I'm okay, not, I'm not calling the police. I'm just. I thought it's, I saw the help. police go in there. Well, police. This is a shared facility with the police department. Hey, Frauditor, I noticed that you stumbled over your words a little bit. Did you get off script? Did you forget it? I mean, what's the deal with that? I hope this uh, school official didn't frighten you so much that you forgot the script. Well, usually there's a public entrance. You know, if somebody needs to come here and talk to you. Well, you need to make those arrangements through the administrative offices. Hmm. This isn't a, there's no, the public doesn't just come here and do business. No, not at all. Not that I'm aware of. I mean, oh. Okay. So. All right. Okay. All right. That's the nice bike you got there. Yeah. Yeah. Is that the? Is that a uh, rat? Like a rad? Um. I have a rad bike. It looks very similar to that. It's not a rad, but yeah, it's an aerial. Yeah. It's, will that run you? Uh, seventeen. Okay, that's about what the rad's got. Yeah, it came with the rack. Okay. Nice. The rear rack. So. All right. Well, you be careful. Yeah, I'm staying on the public sidewalk. Okay. Well, the thing is, you're I just. Like that, you're making our bus drivers very nervous. So I mm -hmm. uh, just thought I'd share that with you in case it matters to you. Well, you're not feelings enforcement, are you? I'm sorry. You're not feelings enforcement, are you? No, but uh, my job is to help make sure our employees and students and okay. faculty. Okay. Well, I'm not. I'm not. You know, none of the students. A little odd. But, but is it odd or just unusual? Well, odd and unusual, I think, would be similar words. So. Okay. Right. Is it? It's not illegal to form. Not it's it's my stay on the right. It's my job to uh, keep our public officials in line. <laughs> A job which you are supremely underqualified for to begin with. You couldn't even tell where you were at to begin with, or how the regulations worked here. You are a complete moron. Okay, whatever your job is, or whatever okay. you work for. Uh, well, you, you'll see it. You sell your articles to, that's yeah, fine. you'll you'll see it when it comes out. Okay, looking forward to it. Yeah, good.
hell now, you gotta love these morons who think they can run everything, but yet wouldn't be able to pass a simple knowledge test on those particular jobs. Yeah, how are you gonna keep people in line if you don't know what the particulars of their jobs are? What a blooming moron.